Alright, hello all you crazy people out there. My name is Dragonite, and we are still not done with Pokemon Blaze Black 2. So, there are a couple of, um... There are a couple of trainer battles that can be had still. And one of them is Game Freak Headquarters. So I'm going to go up to Game Freak Headquarters. Let's go to 22F. And I believe I fought these guys uh, in the uh, the main part of the game when they had, like, when I came through Castilia City earlier. But I don't remember. So I'm going to fight them now. Yes, I would like to battle you. This is uh, Shigeki Morimoto, if I recall. And I'm going to... Uh, who do I have out front? Houndoom? I think I have Houndoom out front. And we're going to be fighting Braviary, who's level 90. And I should probably turn my headphone volumes down a little bit because uh, I can't hear myself think and I don't like that. So we're going to go and... Um, Let's use a nice Dark Pulse, because I think that's the strongest move I have. Ooh, I'm faster. Is Brevere using a uh, decreased priority move? Mm, that didn't do anything. Okay, so you're going to use Fly. And what do I have that can uh, switch in and take a Fly? Oh, Power Herb. That's fancy. Alright, that sucked. Um, Let's see. I was... I, ooh. Okay, I meant to hit Flamethrower, because I remember the Dark Pulse is only 80 power, and Flamethrower has 90, but... Never mind. You're gonna use fly again. And and I think I'm going to switch into somebody who resists fly if I have any anything like that. Let's go and uh actually let's just use an item. Do so I have have a citrus berry? Let's use a citrus berry. I just need to survive this. Doesn't really matter. <clears throat> doesn't really matter if I take this especially well, but I just need to survive this. Okay. So, we can, uh... We can go and use Flamethrower. Because, again, I think that has slightly stronger base power than Dark Pulse does. If that's going to make a difference. And it does. That's a critical hit. I don't think that mattered. I think that mattered. Anyway. Um, leftovers Recovery. Excadrill. Yes, Excadrill. I have, uh, again, a move that's super effective on extra drill. You're gonna, you're gonna mold breaker me. Let's see if I'm faster. Good, I'm faster. Murimoto doesn't seem to have that fast of a team if it's being outsped by a level 82 Houndoom. Go, go, go! No, damn it! Tell me you don't have a white herb too. Or power herb, whatever. Alright, bye. You tried, Houndoom. You tried. Um, I did want Houndoom to get experience and levels and stuff like that round off my team a little bit, but it looks like it was not meant to happen. Um, Dragonite also has a flamethrower. Good. Uh, rip the extra drill, as they say. I don't know why I like saying the word rip, as in like rest in pieces, as in Mew. Okay. Let's let's hammer let's hammer away with outrage and see what happens. Um, outrage. Ooh, Mew is going to use Fly. Okay, so Mew can use Fly. That's a little bit of an unconventional move. Does your entire team have Power Herb? Does your entire team have Power Herb? That was a critical hit, by the way, through the multi-scale. So, that was a little less than half. You're going to dive. Alright, you avoided the attack. Which kind of works out in my favor, because it means that I'm not going to, uh... Yeah, that's not very effective. I'm not going to like, lose the average confusion or anything like that. Ooh, you just hung on by a sliver. Good job, Mew. I have to say, good job. Anyway, Morimoto used a uh, full restore, and we can go hammer away without rage once again. And you're down into the yellow. Let's see if I can hit you one more time. You're gonna use fly. It looks like it's not gonna matter because you're gonna use fly. Don't hit yourself in confusion. I said don't do that. Please. Do it again. Ooh, Amygdala avoided the fly. That's nice. We're gonna use Outrage. Thank you very much. I love the animation for Outrage in Gen 5. I know I've gone off on that before, but... Again! We hang on with just a sliver. Alright. Let's, uh, let's conserve PP. Why are we using die, by the way, and not, not fly? Good, Mew is down! Alright. Migdal gains 8,000 experience, grew to level 83. 
Zebstrika. Do I have anybody with ground type move? I don't think I do. Yes, I do. I have Earthquake on, um, on what's your face? Liver. Okay, Zebstrika. <clears throat> Zebstrika is going to very much enjoy this. Oh, you're going to bounce. Again, you have the power herb. For no reason. It's a move that you should not equip on a Zebstrika ever, but you did. That's super effective, but it didn't do very much all the same because Zebstrika's physical attack isn't all that special. Alright, so we are gonna go and do a, uh, a little bit of HP with that, that Earthquake. And you're gonna avoid the attack. Don't paralyze me because I know Bounce can do that, and I know Bounce can do that quite well. Good. Hit through the paralysis, and Zebstrika's gone down. Alright, I didn't really want the experience on Liver, because Liver's already level 86. All the Mola. Alamomola. Liver's already 80, level 86, but, um... Mm, I don't know who else on my team can take care of his obstacle, so... It is what it is. Alamomola! We're gonna trace the regenerator, so I'm gonna take a wild guess that you're gonna dive also. Yeah, you're gonna dive. And I'm gonna Swords Dance. Save! Yeah! I don't know why I just said save. I think I meant to say... Live, which is something that I say quite a lot in this game, apparently. Uh, you're gonna dive again, which was, uh, I probably should have seen that coming. Leaf Blade, let's go. Live. Ooh, I thought that was a critical hit for a moment. Anyway. <clears throat> Alamomola is going to go and take that Leaf Blade not very well, I think, because it is super effective and it is behind the Swords Dance! <laughs> Yeah. Hyper Potion, let's do this. Murmoto used item, so I can get away with doing the same, right? Anyway, you're gonna dive once again. Nope, don't use another item. We're going to go and uh, Leaf Blade you. Let's see if that brings me into the yellow. It just barely brought me into the yellow. Alright, goodbye, Alamomola. Alamomola, Alamomola, Alamomola. <clears throat> However you pronounce that as. Lipard. Alright, so I'm gonna guess the Lipard has bounce as well. Because, uh... <clears throat> because Lipard can do that. Ooh, you have assist. Oh, you're gonna just call bounce. And you're gonna, you're gonna do that. Alright, so I see your strategy. That's, that was dumb. Let's, uh... Switch on out to somebody else, I think. Unless I want to count on a miss. I can count on a miss. Ooh, I'm faster than a Lipard? What is this? Ankle dive. Pancreas. Let's see. I can bug bite you. You're gonna assist. Oh, this is an... Is this gonna be one of those strategies? Do I just have to PP stall assist? I think I have to PP stall assist. I know what's going on. Um, all right, so I have to use priority or something of that nature. Pancreas is using bullet punch. I'm surprised that I cannot speed the live hard. Because, um, yeah, live hard has the prankster ability, one. And two, isn't live hard supposed to be fast? Pretty sure live hard is supposed to be fast. Anyway, priority punches a hole in this, uh, haha, <laughs> punches, bullet punch. But priority punches a hole in this annoying strategy, so live part is done. That was, uh, don't do that, sir. I saw somebody do that on a uh, Gen 5 random matchup once, and it was fairly annoying, and, um, uh, I defeated them eventually, but man, did that take a long time. Anyway, I'm gonna run off to heal. And we are back, and we are here to fight Ninshino. The Snorlax, yes, the leftovers is important, are important, whatever. Anyway. This guy's gimmick is that he's uh he's got a team based around leftovers, doesn't doesn't he? And Chino, Clefable is up next, and boy is this nice! I can uh I can hit you with dark type moves because this is not Gen Six and you do not have the fairy type. Anyway, um I almost want to hit you with Sludge Bomb because Sludge Bomb is a uh, super effective on fairies, but no, this is not Gen Six. There is no such thing as a fairy type, and that did a good quarter. 
The Fable, Thunder is going to go and uh, paralyze me. Okay. We'll see about that. And with that being said, I think I should switch out to somebody else. Let's go switch into uh, Liver. Because Liver will not take anything from a Thunder. I don't know why you have Thunder. Unless you have Blizzard as well. You might have Blizzard. Anyway, let's go and uh, se uh, seed you. Because seeds are nice. And uh, yeah, you're gonna use Blizzard. Alright, so I should have uh, seen that coming. If I was smart, I'd have the documentation up in front of me and I would know what these guys are gonna use. But there it goes. Uh, I don't know why I should have been su surprised by that. Anyway, I guess I'll be getting some HP back from the, uh, yeah, there goes the Intimidate dropping your attack again. I guess I'll be getting some HP back from the, uh, the Leech Seed now. You're gonna gravity me, because gravity is now a verb. Uh, I'm paralyzed. Do I want to use a healing item? Oh, you have that ability that I can't, I can't drain your HP with Leech Seed, don't you? That's fun. Full heal. Let's go with the full heal. Alright, Ribbon's Cure to Paralysis. Come on. Don't paralyze me. Eee! Again. The weird voice inflections. I know Lapras likes those. Um, can I flinch you with Dark Pulse? Please flinch you with Dark Pulse because that's just... Yeah. Good, you flinched and couldn't move. That's nice. Let's see if... Uh, can I hit you with Sucker Punch? Will that do more damage? Because I know Clefable's uh, special defense is better than its physical. Nope. Okay, so you're going to use Thunder again. Don't kill me. Live. Oh, yeah. I'm paralyzed, but I lived. 248 HP, 15 remaining. Let's use Sucker Punch again. And then Shino's going to use a Full Restore. Why? All right, if you can use a Full Restore, then so can I. This, this battle would have been so much cooler if you didn't use the full restore. All right, so gravity is returning to normal. <clears throat> and I can use a, uh, I have 18 full restores left. So I can do that. Besides, I'm eight levels weaker than you. I think I'm allowed to use healing items. Um, and I'm the playable character, but that's neither here nor there. So we're gonna avoid the thunder this time, which is pretty cool. And we're gonna use a flamethrower. And that did nothing. And we're here having a war of attrition with Clefable, which is just brilliant. That's another paralysis. All right, flamethrower. Avoided the attack. I think that's the last of your thunder PP. Because I think that was five, and an AI usually does not use, uh, AI usually does not use PP ups on their, uh, on their Pokemon. Just a thought. Anyway, so we're gonna drop another full heal. Ooh, so that's not it for your Thunder. So you have at least one more. Okay. I avoided the attack, which I approve of. We're gonna use Flamethrower. I think that's gonna be it for Clefable. Yes, all right, so Clefable went down. We've gained experience. Almost grew another level. And we are uh, we are on our way. Wigglytuff, so the counterpart to Clefable is gonna be uh, up next. Wigglytuff is going to frisk me and found the leftovers, which I think if you've been paying attention more, uh, Nunchino, you should have known already. But... So that's going to do about as much as the... Ooh, Focus Blast. Focus Blast. Focus Blast. Focus Blast. Focus Blast. Focus Blast! Focus. F-O-G-G-U-S. Um, let's see. Amygdala... I'm gonna take a wild guess that you have Blizzard as well, because why wouldn't you? But we're gonna go and use a uh, Outrage. Yeah, I have the multi scale too. Again, boys and nice having fire type not existing at all. And it doesn't matter what you have because Blue Glutuff fainted. Alright, perfect. Porygon 2, which I know for a fact has the Eviolite. Because why wouldn't it? A and just just as a little side detail, this thing may or may not have the uh Ooh, that did about half. Uh, this thing may or may not have Trick Room. <clears throat> have Blizzard as well, is what I was trying to say. Alright. Yeah, you're gonna use Blizzard because of course you are. 
And I'm not gonna take that very nicely even with the multi skill. Come on, hit, 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 hit. No! That's not what I meant by hit. That's not what I meant by hit. That's not what I meant by hit. We'll restore time. I was expecting this battle to be less bad than the, uh, the Morimoto battle, but I guess uh, the game has other ideas. Blizzard's gonna land again. Du, 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 du. All right, I shouldn't try and sing with the music because you already know that already because I can't. Um, we're in the red. All right, that did not, ooh, thunder. That did not restore all that much HP. Outrage. You're gonna blizzard, this is gonna be it for Dragonite. Sorry, mascot. Ooh, boy, does that sting. Ooh, boy, does that sting. The Twisted Dimensions of Return to Normal. Ankle, you have a super effective something or another. I'm down three Pokemon, you're only down two. This is not, this is not boating well. So I have analytics, so boost the power of my moves, my moves if it moves seconds. Which is kind of cool, I guess. Anyway, Porygon 2 died. We're, we're tied in this battle. 3-3. Three to three. Audino! Audino, 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 you give a lot of experience, so I really hope I can defeat you. Come on, don't do anything nasty. Please. Trick Room. Okay, so that's gonna kind of work out in my favor. If I move second, because Analytic will boost the power of my moves. Of your moves, of whatever moves. Gravity, I don't know why you're using gravity, but Trick Room is gonna do like a lot times damage to you because analytic. You're gonna die. Yeah, nice try. All right, 11,000 experience. That was pretty cool. Uh, Blissey is up next. Same same story with the Blissey. And I wouldn't be surprised if you have the Chapel Barrier as well. I think I saw that when I was leaving through the documentation earlier. You're gonna use Thunder. Why? I don't know, but you're gonna use thunder. And thunder paralyzes, because why not? Yeah. <clears throat> and that's the Choppleberry. Look at that HP go. Oh boy. That is beautiful, the rate that that HP bar scrolls. For those of you who don't know, I am not a fan of the way the HP scrolls in Gen 7. I prefer it in Gen 5 when uh, you really feel the weight of your damage when you, when you hit something with a... Uh, a super effective move and you're doing a lot of HP and the HP scrolls slowly. Anyway, Sacred Sword time. Ooh, I'm still faster than a Snorlax. Even with the, uh, the Trick Room. That's a little weird, sir. Anyway, Snorlax went down. I should have brought this guy out earlier and this battle would have been a lot easier, but no, I had to make this difficult and try and use a Hound Demon and whatnot. But, we can battle again tomorrow. Yes, we can. That is not something that I plan on doing because I do not have the time for that. Anyway, what's next up on my list? Um, uh, next up on my list, I think, is uh, a certain Team Plasma N, who you can fight in Victory Road. But before I do that, I need to go back to uh, I need to go back to the Pokemon Center and heal. All right, let's see if I can find you, N, because um, N is notoriously annoying to find, and I don't know if I'm gonna be able to find you. Uh, I'll, I'll find you eventually. Yes, Repel's Effect off. He's another one. I want to say, no, not down there, but down here. Somewhere around here, you can find a, uh, fancy Zoro Zoroark. That's not it. I want to say it's on the other side of that cliff over there, if I can find that, uh, entrance. Um, boy, do I love Gen 5 Victory Road. Just a little detail about me. Anyway. <clears throat> Ooh, dark room. Not the like life is strange sort of dark room, but a, uh, a room that's literally dark, which I suppose dark rooms generally are. Anyway, um, uh, I'm trying to find my way through without flash. Yes. All right, here we go. I think. Are we there yet? All right, I think this is where I want to go. Anyway, Zoroark. How you doing, Quan? All right, so I can follow the Zoroark, and I believe this is a, uh, I believe this is still a section of Victor Road that I've been through before. I think there were some hidden items here earlier, but I can follow the Zoroark, and the Zoroark will lead me here, and here 
those of you who don't know, Quan is the uh, the entrance going down the stairs there, the entrance to a certain castle of a certain Team Plasma from a certain black and white one. Yeah. For those of you who don't know, they kept this model in the game. You came! This! This is Team Plasma's castle, the ruins of Getsus' dreams. The deepest chambers of this castle. This place that holds a special meaning to me. I have to face you there. Follow me. Actually, rather just rather than just leading you there, I'll prefer to follow. That way I can see which path you choose and observe what catches your interest. So I ask you this. Take me to the deepest chamber of this castle. Yes, absolutely. We'll follow. Alright, that's nice. Anyway, this is an item which I think is a protein. I said I think and then, uh... Waited for the text to, to appear before I said what it was, so that makes sense, Dragonite. Is there another item down here? There is. And this is going to be full heal? Flame orb, same thing. Alright, so in case you want to do any uh, flame orb shenanigans. <clears throat> That's another repel. I don't believe there are wild Pokemon in here. Although it would make sense if there were. This is our destination. Let's go inside. Alright, let's put our finger on the correct B button. And I might want to save. Just because. I've seen 586 Pokemon in this Pokedex. That's pretty nice. Come on, save faster. There we go. Save the game. And now... That's the place. Hey, N. It was two years ago, for the sake of Pokemon, for my ideal world, I put my beliefs on the line and battled a certain trainer, and I lost. But at the same time, I learned something important. To make the world better, you must accept different ideas. I learned this from the form. I, le I learned this is the formula for changing the world. Accepting different ideas. I want to see if you're a trainer whose heart is strong enough to do that. Zekrom! Maze! Shock! Zekrom also wants to know what ideals you seek and what how good a trainer you are. Battle with me, are you prepared? Alrighty then, let's do this. So we are going to be fighting a certain end with a certain Zekrom who just, who just happens to be uh, who just happens to be a certain level 100 yeah cause why not you know anyway level 100 Zekrom Houndoom I am going to try and drop a poison on you if I can survive one hit at all Zekrom intimidate ooh ooh that gives me an idea because Zekrom's uh Zekrom's moves are physical because Zekrom is a physical Pokemon so I think we're gonna try and have your uh, half your offenses by swapping in Stone Edge. Okay, that's gonna that's gonna have a critical hit rate. Who nice? Let's try and Leech Seed you. Actually, I'm faster than a Zekrom. That's impressive. You're gonna Outrage, which is going to do super effective damage to uh, Liver. Bye, Liver. And let's bring Rib back in. Again, the Intimidate's a pretty, uh, pretty good idea, I think. Alright, let's Intimidate you. Your attack has been cut in half, so I don't foresee Outrage taking me down. But it still may do a lot of damage. And I would like to, uh, I would like to not die here. Alright, so that's in two-thirds. If I can poison you, speed up the process, that'll be great. Critical hit, that didn't do anything. Oh, you have the leftovers as well. That's gonna, that's gonna do something, all right. I have the leftovers, you have the leftovers, everybody has the leftovers. Um, I'm gonna get a lot of HP back from that, because you're level 100. Yeah. All right, so let's switch out into, now I hit the items pocket again. Let's switch out into the Pokemon pocket and go into Pancreas, because I really, really, really want Rib to get that level. Rib is so close to a level. And you're gonna outrage, and that's gonna do not very effective damage times uh, times half a times half attack to uh, Pancreas. You're gonna become confused due to the fatigue, and you're gonna restore some HP to leftovers, and I'm gonna restore some HP to Leech Seed. All right, we're in business. Let's see what Bug Bite does. I'm gonna Bug Bite a super giant legendary dragon type Pokemon. Bug Bite, and ooh. Oh, you hear yourself in confusion. I thought that was the bug bite damage. Um, okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. And as long as you don't have a full restore, 
I think we're uh, I think we're good here. And have the full restore. And you're gonna snap out of your confusion. Is that a telephone I hear ringing? That's a telephone I hear ringing. All right, I don't recognize that caller ID, so we're gonna pretend that that's not a telephone ringing. Boy, do I talk too fast. All right. Pancreas, bug bite, bolt strike. That's gonna be a little scary. Ow. Ooh, that was like less than half. Okay. Actually, I think it was exactly half. No, not quite exactly half, but it was pretty close to exactly half. All right, let's do that again. Now, we shall see. Ooh, that was a lot of HP restoration. So you're gonna bolt strike again. Boy, do I love the Gen 5 move animations. I know I've gone off on that in the past, but boy, do I love the Gen 5 move animations. All right, we're gonna bug bite again. This is going to go and take you down to a tiny amount of HP. The leech seed might or might not, probably might not take you down. Ooh, Zekrom, Zekrom went down the leech seed, all right. So your sacrifice was not in vain, uh, Superior. All right, Ribgrid level 83. There are the stats, and we defeated Pokemon Trainer N. All right, 20,000 Poke Dollars. I think that was 20,000, it might have been 200,000, I didn't see the zeros. All right, so we're gonna be a uh, Zekrom. Baz. Head shaky animations. All right, I can talk to Pokemon. I know you can. I can talk to dragons, sort of in Skyrimish. Anyway, that's the uh, stupid. I'll trust you with this Dark Stone. That's a Dark Stone. And we're gonna put that in the key items, key items pockets, and we're gonna take that to Dragon Spiral Tower. But for now, I've been going on for long enough. I really should have cut it off before the end of this video, before I started this uh, battle, rather. Uh, my name is Dragonite. I hope you all enjoyed that, and I will see you all later.